hello everyone today we're going to make simple posho and i have taken two and a half cups of uh, posho or fancy that has been finely chopped so in a pressure cooker pan i've added about one and a half tablespoons of oil and i have finely chopped one medium sized onion and i'm going to saute it I happen to be using the uh, red onion but you can use the white onion if that's what you have and I'm going to sort it with one tablespoon of ginger paste once the onions turn slight pink we will add diced tomatoes and I've diced one and a half tomatoes I will add it to this mixture to the tomatoes I will add a teaspoon of salt half a teaspoon of turmeric and one teaspoon of paprika and you may use red chilies if you like we'll add about half cup of water and form a masala and then add the french beans now to the green beans i'm going to add a quarter cup of uh, water i'm going to mix everything up and pressure cook it on medium low for 10 minutes after which i will check it again I opened my pressure cooker after 10 minutes and I adjusted the salt but it wasn't fully cooked so I decided to pressure cook it for a further 5 minutes and I added about 2 or 3 tablespoons of water so that it doesn't dry up. Again I pressure cooked it for medium low for another five minutes and then I checked it again. And before pressure cooking, I added about um, quarter, a uh, quarter teaspoon of garam masala and then I pressure cooked it. I timed myself from start to end. It took me about 17 minutes of pressure cooking in total. So 17 minutes on a medium low heat was good for this uh, posho, but I realized there's no, it's not, there's no heat. So I'm going to add some green chilies. And if, if I had to redo this, I would have added it at the time I added the tomatoes. Um, but since I've already done this, I'm just going to add some green chilies and then just cook it through for one or two minutes and then serve it with hot roti and then we go we'll cook it through for one or two minutes and then everything incorporates well and it is ready to serve there we go to serve and it easily serves about two to three people serve it with hot roti and i'm sure your family will enjoy it See you later.